Hi, I'm Andrea. This is Sarah. We're from the lifestyle blog peanutbutter.com. Welcome to our Keep Calm and Bake series, and today we're going to be making honeycomb. So we're going to put four tablespoons of golden syrup into the pan. For the full list of ingredients and method, just check the description box below. So the pan's on a medium heat right now. It'll take about five minutes or so. You want to make sure it's nice and bubbling and that all the sugar has dissolved. There is not a better sight in life than this. It's like bubbling molten gold. It's very beautiful. And it smells delicious as well. It smells really good. So we have got uh, some reusable baking parchment ready to go. The next step is going to happen quite quickly. We've got a teaspoon and a half of baking soda. We're going to throw it into the pot and whisk it up very quickly and it's going to whoosh up into a cloud. It's really cool but it happens very quickly so we have to be nice and prepared. In goes the baking soda and here we go. Look at that. It's like a big frothy cloud. Just try and get all of it out as quickly as you can. We need to let it set for about 20 minutes, half an hour. It does depend on the temperature of your kitchen. What I like to do when I'm at home is to leave a window open so the nice cool air comes through. Uh, but if your kitchen's a bit warm, maybe put it in the fridge to help it along for a little bit. We've taken it out of the fridge. We think it's set. Looks nice and shiny and hard, so I'm going to give it a good bash. This is the fun bit. <laughs> oh gosh. Can I have one little go? Yeah. It just looks so much fun. It's quite good. It's quite good. Woo! <laughs> <laughs> maybe I okay, shouldn't have had it Yeah, maybe try, try to keep it on the plate. <laughs> okay, we've got a nice little presentation box here uh, to take around to our friend's party. Just put it in and it's going to look really pretty. In addition to this, you can also um, dip the pieces in chocolate for kind of like a crunchy effect. For more recipes like this, hit the subscribe button now. Should we keep a few for ourselves? I think we need to try some. <laughs> yeah, definitely. Please join us next time for more recipes from Keep Calm and Bake.